the headline spells out the seriousness of self-defense. It's scary, I mean, and you just, you want your kids to be protected. That's why Jennifer LaCugnata got her daughter, Emmy, into karate. I stood up, told him to stop, and told an adult. Get loud. No! And get, get going. Go, run, Rachel go. Hughes teaches kids to scream as loud as they can, so yell no, no, then run as fast as they can, and never get into a stranger's car. You don't want our children to be paranoid, but we want them to be educated. Here are a few cold, hard facts about real-life threats to our kids. No! Young girls aged 10 to 14 are taken much more often than boys. These attacks usually take place in the afternoon between 2 and 7 p.m. And 70% of the time, abductors will be driving cars when they spring the trap on their targets. Come with me. No! Research shows children who are passive and polite get abducted more often. If they are taken to a store or a strange place, of always bringing attention to themselves. Some other self-defense tips. Use fingers to the eyes, no! stomp on feet, Move. palm to the chin or throat, it, and bite. Out in the real world, it's something that can happen. And it can happen to your family. Yeah! I'm Jessica Sanchez reporting.